Hi guys, I am Ranga. I am the author of ASP.NET tutorial online.blogspot.com and jQuery example code.blogspot.com. And using this uh, uh, interview question, we are going to learn uh, what are the ACID properties in the relational databases. Uh, so all databases should be uh, having these properties so that uh, you can able to uh, consistently work on the database. So before uh, uh, ex we can call it is database, the database should be having this ACID properties. Uh, ACID is nothing but here atomicity, consistency, isolation and durability come to here uh, atomicity what we can say is uh, it is uh, as uh, all or none rule for database uh, modifications uh, for suppose example if we are doing uh, 30 uh, 30 values uh, 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 30 columns are there uh, you are going to modify 15 uh, columns at a time using the update statement so it should update all the 15 columns uh, at a time it should not fail anyway this is called as atomicity and the consistency is nothing but uh, guarantees that a transaction never leaves your database in half finished state uh, i think uh, it is uh, as like uh, atomicity uh, and then uh, if you go to isolation uh, if you are going to perform two or three operations on the database uh, all transactions should be unique and each other until they are finished all transactions should be active and uh, they should try to close all transactions before uh, uh, database should happen something okay and durability durability is nothing but uh, uh, guarantees that the database will keep track of pending changes in such a way that server can recover from an abnormal termination and committed transactions will not be lost okay so i hope you enjoyed this video and you have learned about atomicity consistency isolation and durability okay uh, so, so let's go for another interview question uh, thank you guys i will catch you in the next interview question bye